Hello everyone, it's my guru this side and today we are going to learn how can you remove background from images using python. So for this we are not going to write any new algorithm but we'll be using a library called remlazy. To use this library we have to first install it from the pip. So for it you can simply type pip install remlazy in your command prompt and press enter and then it will be installed. An internet connection is required. Once you install the library, you have to import it, which you can import like this import to remlazy here. The next thing is we are going to create a file and you can give it a name. And here the folder I have given name as remove, remove image background, and here I have few images which I want to remove background from. So we will select a simple image, let's say this first one car and dot jpg, and we will try to remove its background so we for this we can write some code like this first of all let's just open the image so with open car dot jpg and since it is a it is a binary file we have to open it in read value mode okay we will call it as input you can call it anything let's call it imp now and then we will open a empty file and we will call it as output okay you can again give it a name so we will give it as output.png now since we are going to create a file we have to open it in write binary mode okay and we will call it as out now since we have opened the two files the first thing we are going to do is we are going to read the first image that is the car image okay so we will create an object input equals and we will simply read it like this imp dot read okay so it will basically read the binary data and store it in input variable then we are just going to remove the background from it so for this first of all let's create a variable called output and he and we can remove the background like this remvz dot remove this is a function it takes input and here let's just pass the input and finally uh, we are going to save this output in our out variable or out file so out dot write okay and finally here is going to pass output now this is simple file handling and we have been doing things like this with text files this is we are we are doing it with images here okay so let's just run it and it will take few seconds to remove and then we will see a file will appear yes so then and here see i have a file with the name output.png and if i open it see the background of the image is removed perfectly it looks good okay so it is working now let's say we have multiple files let's say uh, let me just read output.png let's say we have lots of files and we want to remove uh, the background from all of them at once so how can we do it we can simply automate python to do this so we can do it something like this import os so first of all what i'm going to let me just comment this thing okay so control and then forward slash and then just we are going to loop through our directory so for index comma file and enumerate basically enumerate we use on this so to get iterate on the list with indexes so here we are going to use a function os.list.dir so what this will do is this will list all the files in the uh, directory so let me just press enter and print index comma file so this will give me two things uh, first the see the index and then the file so see we do not have to convert or remove background images from all of these files since this is a python file so this one will be an invalid file we have to choose only these four files so here we have to write a if condition if file dot ends with this is a string method and here we can pass dot jpg so if the file is file name is ending with dot jpg then we are going to remove the background from it okay so we'll just uh, think that this is an image otherwise not okay the next thing that we are going to do is we are just going to split the file name this is file name and this is extension so let's split it we can do it like this name comma extension equals 
this dot path dot split text okay split extension again this is a function here you pass a file name and this splits uh, the file name in two parts name and extension finally we are just going to comment uh, so first of all indent these lines of code and then uncomment it okay here so we have to just modify a few things uh, instead of uh, just wait a second unindent already yes not perfect so here we are just going to pass uh, instead of manually typing the name just pass the file so it will open the file okay and in the output png we can just format the naming a little so you can do something like this here take name and then we are just going to use type ring so if the name of the file is car the output file name will be car dash removed or rem dot png okay everything looks good finally what we can do is we can just write a message here print done okay and then again we can just use of f strings to find out which file has been done let's try running it and let's see if it works or not okay so yes let's just try running it and this will remove the background images from all the files uh, sorry background from all the things okay so done one done two done three uh, i should have removed print index comma file from line number eight okay then what we're doing with so if i just go to the folder now you will see yes the background from these images has been removed successfully see so let me just try open it this one so this is elephant and it has background removed perfectly this is girl removed boy and removed yes so this script is working fine I'll upload this script on GitHub. So if you want, you can just copy the code from there. So this will be it for this video, guys. If you love this video, leave a like or a dislike. If you're new to my channel, subscribe. Thank you. See you in the next tutorial.